SeaWorld is essentially saying, okay, we are going to stop breeding these killer whales in captivity. Well, once you stop the breeding program, then you pretty much have announced that you are ending the whole program of using these animals as displays is using them for entertainment. They say what they plan to do now is focus more on educating the public and also talking about how these creatures live in the wild until eventually those creatures, of course, will live out their natural lives. SeaWorld put out a statement this morning. It reads like this. SeaWorld has been listening and we are changing. Society is changing and we're changing with it. SeaWorld is finding new ways to continue to deliver on our purpose to inspire all our guests to take action to protect wild animals and wild places. Now, all of this came uh, to a head pretty much with CNN's documentary, Blackfish. As a result of the airing of that documentary, SeaWorld saw a dramatic decline in the number of people going to its parks. It saw a decline in its revenue and, most important of all, a decline in its stock prices. It got a new CEO a little over a year ago, and it appears that these changes are as a result of this new leadership. They were polling people at their parks, and they saw that the ORCA program definitely was a negative in the minds of many of the public, especially children. And it's the children that tend to tell the parents where they want to go and to what parks, Carol.